Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. Let's see. Uh oh, I bet you this is one of those. Yeah, see, this is what I mean about them being invisible. Uh, in the last part, is that they usually are invisible. And wow, that's a lot of silver rupees. Ah, uh, aha! <laughs> what is this? What is this blasphemy that I see in this room besides that like like that I seen over there and I do not like that in the slightest. I betcha this is a Song of Time place? Maybe? Could be? Yes! <laughs> okay, now I'll have a nice safe bird's eye view around this place and I could kill that like like if I... I seen a keys up there. I could kill that like like if I wanted to. You're going down. So, oh wow. I guess I can't kill it with traditional. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. <laughs> I guess I can. Maybe it was in its invincible mode or something like that, like Rocket Warrior. Anyway, um, just gonna carefully navigate my way through this room. Even with the lens of truth, this room can be a little bit tricky. I can tell. I just wanna look around here is that oh, okay just wanted to be sure why did the lens turn off there um hmm. do I want those hearts I think I do <laughs> I mean I'm getting kind of low there because I'm kind of playing like a doofus uh, but anyway the as you can see, the Lens of Truth only limits you to seeing within a certain range. So, the issue with that is, you can't see the sights coming when they're coming from behind you. Takes care of that one. And I see one at the other side of the room there. You can see that, can't you? Well, you will once I kill it. Oh, shoot. Wait, wait, too touchy. Mm. There we go. Does this do anything? Is there anything hidden? <laughs> well, there's a bunch of hearts over there now. I might as well go get those. Hopefully I won't lose my chance. No, 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 no. I lost my chance. <laughs> well, that's fine. I got three fairies in my inventory, dang it. And the only reason why I put them up there was because of the fact that I was wondering because I had to, like, tank the hits with Shadow Link, and I figured that uh, I was like, well, if, if I have to take a lot of hits with Shadow Link just to get through it, well, I might as well have a lot of fairies to do it as well. I just got them just in case. Anyway, I got the next key for the next place, wherever that may be. And I haven't seen any gold Skulltulas around the area, unless they are invisible or something like that. I would not put that past the designers, that's for sure. <laughs> Um, this is frozen shut once again, but what what does shooting that thing open anyway? I'd really like to know And whenever you see an eye it is definitely worth shooting Oh, wait, wait it's frozen, but it's it's stayed uh, Shot so hmm. back to the normal bow Should I even bother with you guys? I mean you guys are really really seriously in the way like no other thing has been in the way before up to this point. <laughs> I think it's okay. Looks okay. I don't see any like special invisible tricks when I had that thing out. Okay. Let's get ourselves ready. And there we go. Well done! Yeah, these uh, blade traps here aren't really much of a big deal. Even though I seem to be making a much more big deal of them than I should be. All I have to do is stand like right in the middle of those lines and I'll be just fine. So I don't know what the heck I'm being so tentative for. Anyway, I seen this was the solution to those two. But there's only two I see here. Wait, what? Why didn't I land on the other one? That was really, really weird. Let's try that again, I suppose. Before I landed... What? Okay... 
Let's try the tippy top of the target now. Okay, well, I don't understand, but okay. Oh, the other one's over there. Why didn't I see that before? Ah, oh, whatever. That's five. Makes a treasure chest appear over there. That's not a problem. What's inside? Arrows. I betcha that is to shoot that. Uh oh, that's. That blade trap is gonna get me. Oh! <laughs> I tried to duck out of the way. And I can shoot through there. I know I can shoot through here. Come on, man. Don't play. Wait, I am shooting through there. Let's try it like this. Ah, okay. But those normally can be triggered with arrows, so I don't see what's the problem there. Um, well, there's a, there's a locked door over there. There's this open path over here. Decisions, decisions! Wait, can I actually... Yeah, I can go over there now. Okay. But maybe that is what I should do while I still have magic power. <laughs> what does this say? Maybe one of the sacred feet. Oh, okay. I have to put on my hover boots. La 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 la, yay! No, that's what I thought. I was, oh, never mind. I was judging the timing of the platform while it was invisible. And now this is what you need the hover boots for because they give you just enough oomph to get across to the other side. But the other path I want, uh oh. Ah, <laughs> I thought so. So there's spikes in those three places. Okay. There's some redeads. Attack, attack, attack! <laughs> that works so well. I can go across here. Oh, no, I can't. I just walked right on top of the spikes. I don't want to waste magic power. That's that's the thing here, is that why I'm using the Lens of Truth so sparingly is because of that. Okie dokie. What you want to do when you want to get one of these is put yourself between the target and the silver rupee and you should just be able to pull yourself right into it like so uh, there's one up there is this gonna land me right on top of the spikes it certainly feels like it eh? no I'm okay you there no no I wanted to see target you eh, eh. oh wait what is this another treasure chest must get to booty <laughs> blue rupee okay well what is the point of no wait I use the dang C stick again what the heck is wrong with me when will I ever learn it's it's a thing of it's become a force of habit at this point aha okay must use buttons more. Maybe I should like practice that off camera or something like that. Hmm. Am I supposed to jump for this one? Or I should say hover to this one? Yeah, yes I am. Uh, that one, I probably have to hover to as well. That one I definitely pull myself to. And I notice that there's a lot more silver rupees. These are like special custom silver rupees. It's usually five and then that's it. There's a lot more in these rooms. Okay, so now I'll... last one, long shot. I think this will work. Looks like it's in the middle of the room. Yes. Whoa, 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 oh my goodness. <laughs> um. Okay, so I guess I'm going this way. Yeah. Had to avoid the spikes if you didn't realize that. What's in here? Um. <laughs> it's a lot of ums because of the fact that I can't see, you know, many, many traps that we'll find in this world here. Um. <laughs> Staffles! You again? I've had enough of you. <sighs> I've seriously had enough of you. Oh. 
Why are there so many of you? You aren't hard. And stop taunting me! <laughs> All you have to do is attack me so I can kill you. There we go. One more hit should do it. Uh. There we go. Treasure chest. Or not. I'm probably supposed to shoot this wall with my long shot. Maybe. Wait, what? Oh, there's one here. <laughs> well, that explains a lot. No, 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 no. You are coming with me. Whether you like it or not, I need you in a better position. If he's up on top of there, of that platform there, and touching the wall, it would be kind of annoying because I may hit the wall with my sword instead of him. So, yeah, that's why I want him to come over here. Come on. There we go. Die like a skeleton! There we go. <laughs> Treasure! Booty! Prizes! Fame women! <laughs> what is that? That looks like a larger treasure chest than normal. Unless that was just the camera angle that made it look larger. Yeah, it's just a smaller one. I mean, it's just a small chest. Let me... No, hover boots! You are betraying me! Red rupee? Hmm. Um. What's up here? What's this thing? I'm just so suspicious of these murals now, or these paintings, or whatever the heck these are on the walls after the water temple. You can't blame me! Anyway, it appears I can't get further down there? I mean,. I don't have any more keys, and there weren't any more chests, there weren't any crates to break. So, am I forced to move on? <laughs> I guess I'm supposed to go down that other route, maybe. Blades of Doom, no problem. And this is still open for me, that is very nice. You can shoot all you want, I'm going to be running around in the circle, so you're not going to touch me. Hmm. Wow, three treasure chests. I have a feeling this is going to be quite the room. I see this hidden hole. Well, not hidden hole, hidden block, actually. I hear a skull tula. That's like the first real deal skull tula I've heard throughout this entire dungeon. No, wait, that's too far. I would like it to be yeah, right there. Thank you. Is there... I'm hearing the skull too loud, so I figured, like, maybe it was in that room or something like that. Sign! What do you have to say about this? The stone umbrella. Oh, it's referring to this block here. Because whenever you get hit by one of these... I'd like to climb on top of it, actually, but I can't climb on top of it. That's pretty strange. Um, normally, I mean, those things right there, you have to block with this block. Obviously. See, now that, now that it's going to get stuck on top there like that, and you can safely travel underneath it. Uh, maybe I should put that block in between both of them, just to be safe. That also offsets the timing of them, may I add. Hmm. Well, I guess I am pushing this forward a little bit more. I must get the other one stuck. <laughs> They're both, I believe, side by side to each other. Yep, just as I thought. Okay. So now I'll be able to travel under here. Alright. There is this open place here with this treasure chest, which contains arrows. Not what I was expecting. There is... Oh, hello. <laughs> Are you the one that I've heard all this time? I always wonder, why do the tokens appear above the skull to allow once you defeat them? Like, like you'll notice, I automatically reposition myself to aim above the skull to allow once I kill one. It's like, why do they do that? <laughs> um, looking for something that I can grab onto. How about these rats? I think they're rats. 
Why is that... That thing right there, why is that thing so slow? <laughs> the uh, blade trap there. That is the slowest blade trap I have ever seen. <laughs> okay, so what I'm gonna do here is attempt to get on top of one of those spiky thingies, if I can. Can I climb on top of you? No, 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 Ah! <laughs> well, that didn't work out. Okay. Well, I definitely need to pull this block out again anyway. And I'm not that far away. But as you see, once you get hit by one of those things, it resets the room. It's sort of like an instant death, so to speak, if that makes any sense. But what? But the thing is, is that where, or I should say, what am I looking for around here? Is there something... What is that? What is this blasphemy that I see up on top? Oh, that's just a pot. <laughs> I thought that was like a switch or something like that. Yeah, it's nothing too exciting. Oh no, I didn't... <laughs> I got the sign backwards. Well, I know I can't climb up on the spiky things, so I might as well put this block underneath both of them, I suppose. But I didn't see... Like any other things. Hmm. Okay, now it's stuck. I should say both of them are stuck. They can do what they want to do, all they want. Wait, wait, I've seen something. I've seen something there. Or at least I thought I've seen something, unless that was something graphical. Hmm. I think it was something graphical. <laughs> Or maybe I'm seeing things. Do, do, do. Can I light? No. Can't grip on to the chains. Alright. Can't climb up on the block. Can't grab on to the chains. Seemingly nothing to climb on top of. Seemingly is the, the thing. Ow. And I get hit by the slowest spike trap or blade trap ever. Wow. I, I mock the blade trap and then I get hit by it. <laughs> Okie dokie. There's more to this. I guarantee you there's more to this. Let's look up. Is there anything... No. Nothing of interest to me. Will that block, like... Oh! I get it. I have to pull the block all the way to the other side, because that ledge... I should say, this this part of the floor right here, it's just a little bit higher than the, uh, than the rest of the floor. I'll bet any money... Well, actually, I shouldn't say that. This is Master Quest we're talking about here. <laughs> I'll bet that... Once I pull a block all the way to the other side, I'll be able to hop on top of it and get the booty that is waiting for me. Yes! <laughs> I thought so. Sneaky, sneaky. I can climb on top of these. Yes, I can. Good. Treasure chest here, and then there's one left in the room. Blue rupee, I don't need that with my ridiculously full wallet. Come to think of it, there really isn't much more that, that you have to pin- no! What? <laughs> I was gonna say, come to think of it, there isn't really much more that you have to pay for in this game. Besides, like, one more minigame? There's a key that I'm looking for. Well, luckily, I didn't have to redo this room from the start, but anyway, this room is apparently cleared along with the Skulltula. So I think this is a good time to end off the part, and I'm going to backtrack over to that other room that had the key in uh, at the start of the next part. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you then.